Hi, this is Shadi, Shiro Saigo, another guardian of the Kodokan, one of the first Yudansha known for his mastery in Yama Arashi and the model of the hero in the novel Sanshiro Sugata. However, much like Yoshitsugu Yamashita, Shiro Saigo was another hot-headed troublemaker. In 1890, Shiro Saigo, who was drunk, challenged a sumo wrestler by the name of Araomi to a fight. Saigo threw him down, and while he was down, Araomi bit Saigo's leg, which ultimately resulted in a huge brawl between Saigo's corner and Araomi's corner. When the police stepped in to break up the fight, Saigo injured some of them and threw some of them in the river nearby. Much like Yamashita, Saigo was also arrested, but thanks to Kano Shihan, he was later released. This incident forced Saigo out of the Kodokan. Saigo deeply regretted it to the point of moving to Nagasaki and training Kyudo as a way to redeem himself and atone for his mistakes. Learning from history is a great way to avoid mistakes so they won't be repeated centuries later. Judo's history is filled with excitement, values, and tools that allow us to better ourselves. Physical education can be easily found on the mats, but the moral and intellectual education are the hardest to acquire. We should always strive to seek them out. This was Shadi, and thank you for listening. Please like this video if you found it informative. It's the easiest way to support me and consider supporting me on Patreon to keep this content going and evolving. Thank you.